Khan, we'll begin with uh, with that game having been your first start at home here at Franklin's Gardens. How did you find it? Um, yeah, it was, I was you know really looking forward to it. You know, my first start, as you said, um, in front of the big crowd that we get every, every game. Um, it was exciting for me, for myself to get out there with the boys, um, hearing the crowd, and knowing you know it's a sellout, which is pretty awesome. Been on the bench a few times at home. Um, Getting the the feeling from the bench is uh, you know another level, and then moving up to to start was um, was pretty awesome. Especially getting six tries, you know, people were you know predicting a close game between the pre the, the Aviva Premiership's top two teams going into the game, but you know six tries and a 20-point winning margin. Did you see that coming? No, no. Well, um, well we knew we had the game plan and structures of. Um, of how to play against a, a top team as Saracens are, you know, they're a good, good side. And we knew it was, we knew it was going to be close and, and tough, but, um, you know, to get six tries is a pretty awesome um, achievement. You know, we've we got some good players and we've got some good depth in our squad, which is um, a, a bonus, you know. A few players out, some key players out uh, with England, um, likewise with Saracens, but, um, you know, um, being here at home and the crowd behind us is, is a great feeling. In the second half, they threatened a cut bank on a couple of occasions. You know, they scored two tries, um, but you came back and hit them straight away. Is that really, you know, that really characterised the the character of the lads today? Yeah, after they scored in that second half, you know, we sort of just regrouped. Um, the the chat out there was was good from from the skipper and um, you know amongst the boys. We sort of just, I guess, we panicked a little bit, let the you know a couple of holes, um, let them score. Um, Defensively, we've been quite solid, and you know we just got to trust in our systems, and um, we should, you know, should take care of things. The uh, you know the the rain this morning held off, and uh, obviously there's the weather coming in tomorrow. It's almost that perfect window for the style that was played, given all the offloading and, and the running today. Yeah, exactly. I woke up this morning, it was a bit of sunshine, you got a bit cloudy and grey, bit of rain, sort of held off throughout the match, which is pretty awesome. Um, you know, it's especially for supporters that kind of want to, I guess they want to watch a good free-flowing game um, and I guess we gave that to them with um, the six tries and the way Saracens play, they um, sort of entertained a bit as well. Ken, obviously today the first real test for the Saints without international players that are missing, uh, how much of a statement was that? Uh, yeah, we just want to uh, play how we, we were playing last week and you know, we uh, the momentum carried on this week, uh, even with the, some of the boys gone. It just shows that we've got a strong squad this, this season and um, guys who haven't played before and getting the opportunity, they took it today. Last week against Osprey, you went in at the break in the lead. There was perhaps a bit of disappointment that you didn't kick on after the break. Was that a big message at half-time today? Yeah, it was. Um, you know, we started strong uh, today and, and especially on, uh, after half-time. and That was the, the key message sent us in the changing room that we should uh, start strong and finish strong in that second half. Plenty of great team tries today and in the season so far. Is that a sign of how well the team are playing, that you're putting tries like that together? <laughs> yeah, the team cohesion is good. Um, you know, we, we work on it at, at training. Um, everyone's passing the ball to each other. Everyone's getting to know each other. And uh, it just showed out on the field today. Another try for you in that bottom right corner. It's yeah. becoming a familiar spot for you, isn't it? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> no, it was good. Um, it was a special try because uh, my, my mum's over from, from New Zealand and she's sitting up on that side. So it was good, yeah. Tell us a bit about Big Samu's try because obviously yours was a straight run in. His was a bit of an outrageous sidestep. Did he give you a bit of a ribbon for that? <laughs> he wore tonight, uh, but it was good from the big man. Uh, you know, I thought he was going to run over um, good there, but uh, he showed a step, and he's going to be talking about it tonight. Just back on a serious note, I guess no one will be getting too carried away with this London Irish away next week. Uh, another big game. Yeah, it is. Um, we, we, yeah, we're going to enjoy our win tonight, but uh, come Tuesday we'll be. Uh, ready for London Irish and uh, it showed last year that we kind of went off track um, against London Irish and they're a good team but yeah, it's going to be different this year.